Hello everyone, welcome back to Map TV. I'm Leo Maverick and I'm super excited to be here with you today. After some time away, we are finally bringing Map TV back. And this time, we are coming with lots of new content, new ideas and new energy. Now, for those who don't know me, I've been working in the tech industry as a software developer for over 20 years. I've seen programming languages rise, evolve, and sometimes disappear, but one of them has stood the test of time, and that one was Java. And that's exactly what we are going to cover here about today. Why Java still matters in 2026? Why it's worth learning and how it can open real doors for your career. Also, all the material here will be in English because I just want to help as many people as possible around the world learn and grow in tech. Before we dive in, let me tell you a bit about MAV TV. This channel is a source of knowledge in technology and programming language, a space where we learn in a simple, direct and practical way. Here we'll talk not only about code, but also about logic, mindset and career development in IT world. Because programming is not just about writing code, it's about solving problems and creating opportunity. So let's start from the basic. What exactly is Java? Java is a general purpose, object-oriented programming language created by James Goslin and his team at Sun Microsystems in back to 1995. The idea behind Java was simple but revolutionary. Write, ons, run, anywhere. That means code reading in Java can run on any device that has the Java Virtual Machine or JVM, whether it's Windows, Mac OS or Linux. This flexibility made Java one of the most widely and used and respected programming languages in the world. At first, Java was used for small web applications, those old applets in the browser, but soon it became the backbone of enterprise systems, banks, airlines, Android apps, and even NASA software. In 2010, Oracle acquired Sun Microsystems, and from there, Java evolved rapidly, from Java Age, which introduced Lambda Expressions, to Java 21, which brought virtual threads for better performance and scalability. The best part? Even decades, Java remains backward compatibility. Your old code still runs today. That's one of the reasons companies trust it for critical systems. Now you might ask, why is Java still alive after so many years? And here's why. It's everywhere. Java runs on billions of devices. It powers everything from credit card systems to Android apps to big servers in the cloud. It's safe and stable. Java's strong typing, garbage collection, and major ecosystem make it one of the most reliable languages ever created. It's fast and scalable, with improvements in the JVM and new features like virtual threads, Java now can handle massive 
workloads efficiently. It's career proof. Learning Java gives you opportunities in backend development, cloud computing, data engineering, and more. In short, Java isn't just surviving, it's thriving. Now let's talk about you. If you are starting your programming journey, Java is one of the best first languages you can learn. It teaches you structure, logic, and how to think like a real developer. Once you learn Java, pick up other languages like Python, Kotlin, or JavaScript becomes much easier. Because Java gives you the foundation for understanding how software really works. And beyond the language, you join one of the largest and most active developer communities in the world, full of documentation, tools, and open source projects. Here on MavTV, my mission is to make learning technology simple and accessible. I will guide you step by step from your first Hello World program to build real world applications. We will talk about the Java Virtual Machine, how to install Java, the basics of objective oriented programming, and how to use frameworks like Spring Boot to build modern systems. By the end of this series, you will not only understand Java, you will understand how the tech world works behind the scenes. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on the notifications because there's a lot more coming soon. This is just the beginning of a new era for Mav TV, and I can't wait to share more knowledge, tips, and insights with you. Leave a comment below telling me where you are watching from and why you decided to learn Java. I'd love to hear from you. I'm Leo Maverick, and this is Mav TV, your source for technology, code, and inspiration. Code smart, dream big, and see you in the next one.